Hello, this is Sandro Forte. Today we are going to talk about advocate clients. Now, in any sales business, in any advice-based business, we know the importance of asking for referrals. But one of the reasons why a lot of people don't get referrals is that at the very early stages of a relationship, there isn't enough trust established, so it's very difficult to get a positive outcome when we ask. And we typically get things like, I want to think about it or let me get back to you. And unfortunately, what then happens is we stop asking for referrals. Now we'll deal with referrals in other videos, but just for today, think about the clients with whom you have already established great relationships with. And as you know, again, from previous videos, my A clients are those with whom I have a fantastic relationship and there's future business opportunity. The Bs are those where there might not be opportunity for whatever reason, but I still have a great relationship. In other words, the quality of my clients, if I'm segmenting, is based on the quality of the relationship, not necessarily about how wealthy someone is. So every year, usually at the start of the year, I go out and meet my top 20 clients. And those top 20 are those with whom I have the best relationships. Why? Not because there's greater business opportunity, but because they love me and I love them and we both know it. So I invite them for a coffee, typically, and I sit down and just say, and I think about a conversation I had with a lovely client of mine, Linda, about a year ago. And I simply say, Linda, you know, as I look at uh, this year and, the, and the, the 12 months that lie ahead and the business opportunities that I'm trying to generate, what I'd love you to do is to see if you can keep your eyes and ears open to recommend me to anyone you know that would benefit from the services I provide. Now, this is different to a normal referral because I already know Linda. We have an established relationship. I'm not simply selling the idea that she is to introduce me to someone who needs financial planning or whatever it is that I offer as a service. She knows that I'm offering service-based advice, a relationship that has spanned the test of time. She and I have known each other for about 17 years and she knows the care, the lengths I go to in order to support uh, and help her as a client. So it's a very different kind of conversation to the normal referral question that we might get at the point of sale, uh, to use phraseology that has probably stood the test of time. I'm not sure that it's appropriate to use those words anymore. But uh, don't overlook the importance of advocate clients. If you can find 10, 15, 20 clients who are constantly on the lookout for new business opportunity, that adds an extra dimension to the business that you are looking to grow.